Welcome to the Tick Mill Update. I'm Kiana Danielle, the founder of the Invest Diva movement. Last week was an overall positive week for the US dollar thanks to improving US China trade developments and net positive US economic updates. Next week, the Canadian dollar, Euro, and the Aussie dollar will take the spotlight as we welcome economic data from their respective countries, like the Bank of Canada's rate decision, Australia's unemployment rate, and the Eurozone's Zoo Economic Sentiment Survey. Today, I'm looking at the CAD yen pair, which successfully has completed half of its reverse head and shoulder chart pattern that we identified last month reaching the second profit target and the 50% of natural retracement level of 84.55 while remaining above the daily Ichimoku cloud. The next key target is set at 85.65 but now the question is that if we'll see a temporary pullback here as the pair regains energy to stay in its current bullish trend. Canadian rate decision could play a massive role in the pair's medium-term fate, so I'd recommend staying put before jumping in so that we have a more solid bullish signal. During the pullback, the pair could go down to the 38% of natural retracement level of 83.53. Now, what do you think about CAD Yen's price action. Do you think the bullish momentum is strong enough to break above the current resistance without first pulling back? Let me know down in the comments. Of course, trading the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel, and I will get back to you with more updates tomorrow.